Reaction to all of this, uh, the Dave Maney, the expert press CEO, Jim Bianco, Bianco Research President, macro strategist. Jim, uh, what do you make of this? If bosses are starting to say uh, we're looking at layoffs, uh, and we've already known that the number of available jobs w uh, fell dramatically, uh, that things could be swinging back toward the boss's favor, which in this environment might not be that great. Yeah, I mean, it could be, but that's kind of what a boss's job is to do, is to tell KPMG that they're going to cut people. They always do. Yet we've produced more than 300,000 jobs every month. Hmm. We have a five-month low in initial claims. Yes, we saw a big drop in the JOLTS report, but we saw one of those two months ago, and it got revised away. Uh, and it's still, even if it's not revised away, we've still got 1.67 open jobs for every unemployed person. That's extraordinary that it's above one. It's never been above one. So I get it. Everybody thinks that the labor market's supposed to be in a bad place, but it really isn't. And actually, that's part of the problem for the bond market and the Fed. They want it to slow down, and that's why they've been so aggressive. That's an interesting read on it. You know, Dave, I always think that bosses like their workers to be paranoid. I, I, I'll, give, I'll be generous and say it, it makes them more productive. But otherwise, they just might relish making their workers feel paranoid. So I'm wondering if we're to read into this that uh, at the very least, they're going to cool it on hiring. That seems to be the, re the reading from Meta which, it, it, of, of Facebook fame now actually looking at cutting 15% of their workers, and to put the fear of God in them for a host of reasons, including you better get your butt back into the office here. You know, the remote work thing is going. They're the first target, apparently, the remote workers. So what do you make of all this? Yeah, a lot to unpack there, Neil. Look, I think that the, the you know the paranoia that you're describing, or the or the the tension that you're saying they that bosses want to impart, is coming in part because the bosses are feeling the tension on their own goals and their own expectations and their earnings pressure. There is no question that the entrepreneurial community and growth companies and software companies like ours are absolutely under capital markets pressure and earnings pressure and sustainability pressure, financial sustainability, and that you look and sort of say, what is my employee count and how tightly are they integrated and are there things I can contract and I never see this guy or this woman? So what what does that mean? So there's a lot of dynamics at play, and by and large, they do not augur in toward the benefit of traditional jobs and traditional employment relationships. So yeah, there's pressure. Gentlemen, I want to thank you very much. It must be some of what you said briefly. We were in positive territory, now even money after being down about 300, actually a little bit more points.